Hello students, welcome to EduFarm, Believe and Become, classes for GPAT and NIPAT JW. If you like to share our videos, subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon to never miss any update. So today we are going to learn bicyclic and spiral compound nomenclature according to IPC system. So what is bicyclic compound? Look at the picture, there are a 6 membered ring, ring A and a 4 membered ring, ring B, joined together by 2 carbon atoms, one is here and another is here. These 2 carbon atoms are known as BHC, bridge headed carbon. The joining of these 2 ring system is known as bridge and these two carbon atom join these two system together so these two carbon is known as bridge headed carbon atoms now for nomenclature we should numbering we should start numbering at first so for numbering in bicyclic compound we start numbering with any of the bridge headed carbon atoms so if we number we start with this one then we should go towards the larger ring larger ring means the ring system with more number of carbon atoms so in this picture there is ring A have 4 carbon atoms and ring B have 2 carbon atoms without the bridge headed carbon so we should go towards ring A for numbering so this is carbon number 2, this is 3, this is 4, this is 5, this is 6, this is 7 and this is 8 so the name according to IPSC nomenclature should be bicyclo then a third bracket in between the third bracket we should mention the number of carbon atoms of large ring system here the large ring system have 1 2 3 4 carbon atoms so here it is 4 then we should mention the number of the small ring system carbon atoms here the small ring system have 2 carbon atoms so 4 dot 2 now in between the bridge headed carbon there is no any there is no other carbons so it is mentioned as zero so 4.2.0 .2 4 means there are four carbon atoms in the large ring system 2 means there are two carbon atoms at, at the small ring system and zero means there is no carbon atoms in between the bridge headed carbon and now look the total number of carbon total number of carbon here is 8 so the name should be oct n n because there are all single bonds so the name is bicyclo 4.2.0 oct n here are another example of bicyclic compound this is ring a this is ring b these two ring are joined by two carbon atoms whenever two fused ring system joined at least by two carbon atoms this type of system known as bicyclic compound here in this picture this bicyclic compound the BHC the bridge headed carbon in between the bridge headed carbon means in between this and this carbon there is one another carbon so for nomenclature we should first do the numbering the numbering is always start from any one of the BHC any one of the bridge rate carbon we should start the numbering from them so suppose this is carbon number one then the next criteria is we should follow the numbering system towards the largest ring first largest ring means which ring have more number of carbon here ring a have 1 2 
थ्री कार्बोन एटम रिंग बी हैव टू कार्बोन एटम्स सो रिंग ए इज लार्जर सो द नंबरिंग उल गो टूवर्ड्स रिंग ए सो दिस इज कार्बोन नंबर टू दिस इज थ्री दिस इज फोर दिस इज फाइव दिस इज सिक्स दिस इज सेवन सो द नेम उल बी बाइसाइक्लो a third bracket in between the third bracket at first mention the carbon number of large ring system large ring system have 1 2 3 carbon atoms so the three dot now mention the carbon number of small ring system the small ring system have two carbon atoms so 3 dot 2 now in between the bhc in between carbon number 1 and carbon number 5 there is one carbon atom so this is known as 3.2.1 3 is carbon number of ring a 2 is carbon number of ring b 1 is carbon number there is one carbon between the two joining carbon so there is all total there is eight carbon One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and one is here. So the total carbon number is eight. Total number of carbon is eight. So thus, it is known as octane. So the name will be bicyclo three dot two dot one octane, A N E octane because. all bonds are single bond here if there is any double bond then it will be octene if there is any triple bond then it will be octene y n e this is a bicyclic compound with a bromine substitution so for the nomenclature we should start with numbering the number is start with any of the bhc bisulfate carbon atom here are two bisulfate carbon one is here and one bisulfate carbon is here and another bisulfate carbon is here so if we start numbering with this one then the numbering is goes towards the larger ring system here this is the larger ring system so this is carbon number 2 this is 3 this is 4 this is 5 this is 6 this is 7 this is 8 so if we consider this carbon as carbon number 1 then our bromine is we will get our bromine at carbon number 8 now look at this same compound if we start with this bisulfated carbon as carbon number 1 then what will we get then again we should go towards the larger ring system first this is the larger ring system as it has the more carbon atoms so this is One. This is carbon number two. This is three. This is four. This is five. This is six. This is seven. This is eight. So look at first at case A and this suppose this case B. Both are identical at both are identical compound. Both are same compound drawn here. at first at case a we start numbering with this carbon as carbon number 1 and we get bromine at eighth at carbon number 8 position and in case b we start with this carbon as carbon number 1 and we get bromine at seventh position according to iupac nomenclature whenever in which case we get the substitution at lower position at lower carbon system this that nomenclature should be accepted so this is not a correct system of nomenclature we should follow this one because we get the bromine here at seven position here we get the bromine at eight position our aim is to get the substitution at lowest number of carbon so the name will be bicyclo actually it is 7 bromo sorry so the name will be first first name of the 
substitution the substitution is 7 bromo then bicyclo then a third bracket in third bracket we should mention the large ring system carbon then second large ring system then the smallest ring system carbon then the number of any carbon if that is present in between the bridgeted carbon so at the larger larger ring there are one two three four carbon atoms so this four dot in the smallest ring sorry uh, in the smallest ring there are two carbon atoms so it is four dot two dot in between two bridgeted carbon there is no in there is not there is no presence of any other carbon so this is zero now look at the total number of carbon total number of carbon here is eight this compound all total have eight number of carbons so this is known as octane so the nomenclature is 7 bromo bicyclo 4.2.0 octane why 4 4 because the larger ring this ring have four carbons why 2 because the smallest ring have two carbons why zero because in between the bridgeted carbon there is no any other carbon present so 4.2.0 octane why octane because total number of carbon is 8 why n a n e because there are all single bond so the nomenclature is 7 bromo by cyclo 4.2.0 octane this is a bicyclic compound but here two rings have exact same number of carbon so there is no larger ring or no smaller ring so in case of this type of compound in case of numbering we should start from any one of the BHC if there are equal number of carbon at either side then we should go for the substitution in which way we get the substitution faster this that will be the way of our numbering so if we start numbering from here if this is carbon number one as in bicyclic compound the numbering is always started with the BHC bridge headed carbon so this carbon will be the first carbon or this carbon will be the first carbon any one of any of these two carbon will be carbon number one but if we start with this carbon then we get OH at C3 position if we start with this carbon as carbon number 1 then we will get OH at C4 position so this is the correct numbering system so this is carbon number 1 this is 2, this is 3, this is 4, this is 5, this is 6, this is 7, this is 8, this is 9, this is 10. So the name will be bicyclo. A third bracket in between the, in between the third bracket. There will be the, there is 4 carbon at ring A again there is 4 carbon at ring B in between the carbon number 1 and 6 in between the joining carbon there is no any other carbon present so 4.4.0 there are all total 10 carbon present in this system so this is DEC DECAN DECAN means 10 carbon then we should give a hyphen they at third position there is a hydroxy group then three all we know that according to IUPS nomenclature OH or hydroxy group named as OL all just like alcohol CH3OH is CH3OH 
दैट इज मिथानॉल और मिथाइल अल्कोहल सी एच थ्री सी एच टू ओ एच दैट इज इथानॉल दैट्स लाइक इट इज बाई साइक्लो फोर डॉट फोर डॉट जीरो डेकन थ्री ऑल मीन्स एट थ्री पोजिशन देर इज अ ओ एच ग्रुप प्रेजेंट सो हियर एट टू कम्पाउंडस टू बैसालिक कम्पाउंडस वन इज कम्पाउंड ए एंड दैट इज कम्पाउंड बी पॉज दिस वीडियो ट्राई ऑफ योर ओन द एंसर ऑफ द नोमिक्लेचर ऑफ दिस टू कम्पाउंड इज गिवेन एट द डिस्क्रिप्शन ऑफ दिस वीडियो ट्राई इट केयरफुली सो नाउ वी विल लर्न स्पाइडो कम्पाउंड वाट इज स्पाइडो कम्पाउंड लुक एट दिस स्ट्रक्चर दिस इज अर्गनिक कम्पाउंड हियर एट टू रिंग सिसटेम रिंग ए एंड रिंग बी फ्यूज टूगेदर with just one carbon there is just one single carbon atom join this two ring system whenever only one carbon atom join two ring system that is known as pyro compound in bicyclic compound there are two joining carbon known as bhc bridge headed carbon but in pyro compound there are only one joining carbon at the middle so now look at the look at this joining carbon this joining carbon is always a 4 degree carbon what what is a 4 degree carbon what does that mean that means that a 4 degree carbon is a carbon which is attached with another 4 carbon when whenever one carbon atom joined with other four carbon atoms known as four degree carbon this carbon at the the joining carbon here attached with this 1 2 3 and 4 this four carbon atoms joined with this jo with this carbon at the middle so this middle carbon is known as a four degree carbon for the nomenclature of spido compound we should start the numbering with any one of the adjacent carbon of the middle carbon this is the middle carbon and this four carbons are the adjacent carbons so any one of this should be carbon number 1 now the second rule is coming the second rule is that for numbering we should go towards the smaller system smaller ring system first in bicyclic compound we at first go for the larger ring system but in spiro compound we go for the smaller ring system here in this compound ring b is smaller so the middle carbon the adjacent carbon of the middle carbon is carbon number 1 this is carbon number 1 because ring b is smaller so we start numbering with the ring b so this is carbon number 1 this is carbon number 2 this is carbon number 3 this is 4 this is 5 this is 6 now the name will be spido in a third bracket at first we should mention the smaller system the smaller system the carbon number at the smaller system has two carbon we should never mention the joining carbon so without this joining carbon the smaller ring system has two other carbons so here is two now at the larger ring ring a have three carbons so 2.3 now count the total number of carbon in the in this picture in this given compound there is there is six number of carbons so this is hex n so the name will be spiro 2.3 hex n so what will be the name of this compound this is a spiro compound because ring a and ring b here this is ring a and this is ring b 
joined by only one carbon atom so this is pyro compound so for the numbering we will start from here because in, in spyro compound the numbering is start from the lowest ring system so this is carbon number 1 this is 2 this is 3 this is 4 this is 5 this is 6 and this is 7 so the name will be 1 bromo spyro in the third bracket first the number of carbon at the smallest ring there are two carbons dot number of carbon in the largest ring there are four carbons 2.4 one bromo spyro 2.4 hex because sorry hept because there are seven carbon all total so this is known as hept hyphen at five position there is a double bond so hept five e n e in so the name will be one bromo spyro 2.4 hept five in so here is an example of spyro compound you try to find out the IPS name of this compound. The exact name of this compound is given in the description of this video. That's all for today. Check more of our videos and let us know of any query in the comment section below. Also, you can suggest topics for our next video. You can also support us. Check the description for details. Your support will encourage us to make more such videos. Thanks for watching. Hope to see you in our next lecture. Till then, keep your preparations on with EduFarm.